Good sightings, fellow friends of the world, it's Zeklo, and welcome to a mod showcase featuring Daniel the Spectromancer, by the Company of Creators. All the informative links can be found in the description below, so let's get started. Daniel has 130 health, 150 hunger, 180 sanity, and 150 fatigue. A new stat exclusive to him. He starts with Jerry, a unique item, and a fur roll as well as knowing a few sleep and magic-related recipes right off the bat. He's the full package with custom art, quotes, and sounds, or even a few additional things that we will mention shortly. So fatigue, this is the main downside to Daniel. Unlike most other stats, this one starts low and then raises. You don't want it to get too high or else you'll start suffering from grogginess and even spontaneous sleeping. There are a number of ways to keep tiredness from raising. As you might expect, sleeping. Using sleeping rolls or tents will lower the fatigue. Daniel is even capable of crafting two new sleeping bags that degrade based on how long you use it and not how many times you use it, like the normal sleeping rolls. Being wet and getting attacked by Charlie in the dark will also lower your tiredness. Starving, overheating, freezing, fighting certain creatures, mostly bosses, getting struck by lightning, and being in the ruins during the climax of the nightmare cycle will pause Daniel's fatigue for a period of time. So don't worry about becoming groggy in situations like this, as you can't. There are also a number of foods which will raise and lower his tiredness accordingly. You can find the specifics on their form link. As for Jerry, this is Daniel's main perk. Gotta have something to make it worth going through all that, right? This is a unique item to Daniel, and they can only be held by Daniel. They act like a walking cane, which makes dealing with grogginess a bit better, and they also speak, informing the player of things and having overall fun lines as well. They deal 15 damage, but can deal up to 15 more depending on the player's sanity, plus an additional 30 to nightmare creatures and ghosts. Perfect for supernatural hunting. The really cool part comes in the form of haunting. Jerry is capable of haunting something at the cost of 10 hunger, letting you do things that could only previously be done by ghosts. There's more though. When a mob reaches 15% or lower of their health, Jerry can claim their soul. This will cost 20 hunger and 30 sanity, or 40 hunger and 75 sanity, if it's a giant soul. A claimed soul will fight for Daniel so long as it lives. Er, you know what I mean. They have 250 health to do so, or 1000 for a giant soul. Daniel can only have 3 claimed souls at a time, or a single giant soul. Having a claimed soul will lock Daniel out of a portion of their tiredness, keeping them always a bit fatigued. 12% for each normal soul, and 36% for a giant soul. These can be freed whenever the player wishes. Do note, Jerry has a cooldown of 2 minutes after claiming a soul and will not function in that time. Daniel is also compatible with modded skins, mods in the menu, and status announcements. Currently, they have one skin, the gender bent, but I'm sure they'll have more soon enough. <laughs> not only do they skin the character themselves, but the related items and features as well. You <laughs> take notes, Clay! Jerry, or Jenny, is super fancy too. It's just a skin, but look, they're a floating skull that follows the player. Crazy, right? Not only that, but check it out, their voice is higher. Jerry is referred to as Jenny, even the tiredness meter is changed, and the claim souls too. That's a dedication. That's Daniel the Spectromancer. Definitely worth checking out, so go down in the description below, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you for tuning in, and farewells. <laughs>